durian. Here we go. Ah, wait, wait, wait. Ah, sorry, sorry. Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Mike? Good morning, guys. It is Sunday and we are totally excited to be back in Bangkok, Thailand. We started off with a quick breakfast at the hotel. We're staying at the Indigo Hotel in Wireless Road. It's located in a very good area for us to venture out today and explore food in Bangkok. Today we have a cooking class at the hotel. We're going to learn to cook some Thai food. And then in the evening we're going to venture out, visit some night nice street food markets, just to see what Bangkok has to offer food-wise in general. You have crazy hair. <laughs> it's crazy hair, I don't care. In the morning. But it was flat really well. Yes. I, I wanted to mention that. Yeah, we were both locked out. <laughs> And this is our amazing breakfast here. Excellent. <laughs> We're actually going to do a Thai cooking class with Chef Jimmy. He's going to show us all the tricks. He's going to show us how to prepare Thai food in a delicious way. And I can't wait to prepare and eat the food. <laughs> Hi, good morning from Bangkok. My name is Jimmy. Welcome to our lovely fans. Hotel Indigo will teach you how to cook perfect Thai food. Follow me, please. <laughs> What are all the ingredients that go into the pomelo salad? Our uh, ingredients we have cafe lamb. Mm. This cafe lamb leaf. This good for salad and for the soup, mint leaf. Mint. Look at my mouth, mint leaf. Mint. <laughs> and this water chestnut. Water, water chestnut. Okay. And what? then we have the peanut here. Roasted peanut. Uh huh. Dry shrimp. What oh. is that? Dry shrimp. Yeah, ah. dry shrimp. Yeah, dry shrimp. Roasted coconut. We have the crispy garlic. Crispy garlic, okay. Crispy shallot. Crispy shallot? Okay. And then, oh, oh, happy birthday. <laughs> and then see the pomelo salad. That's it. That's we make from the tamarind, the sugar, and fish sauce. Tamarind, sugar, and fish sauce. <laughs> So good. Very refresh. Mm -hmm. Really, oh my god. If you love spicy, you can add chili powder. Later, no problem. Nah? Let's add spicy, huh? Uh, this salad is quite easy. Uh, when you talk about a Thai salad, you think only formula, only papaya salad. No, no, no. We have a lot of thousand salad for you. Yeah. Yes or no? <laughs> So clearly the best thing about a Thai cooking class is once you've cooked all this delicious food, you actually get to eat it, which is the, the even better part of uh, cooking it, right? Yeah, and I think we spotted a few secret ingredients yes, um, that sure. we, are, we were actually missing when we cooked it at home. Beautiful. The, pork, you must have with the fresh vegetable. Mm. Because uh, why uh, Thai people all ha or we have the raw or fresh vegetable? Because we have from the organic farm, mm -hmm. not chemical. That's yeah. why make you more s beautiful skin. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can use your hand, no problem for Thai style. So, what's the first impression? Red curry is absolutely amazing. Just having the spicy, the creamy, 
and then the fruity from the pineapple mixed together it's just so good just said thai food is number one food for us because it's just so incredibly diverse and, and delicious flavorful. yeah and yeah. fresh a fun experience right yeah it was really nice to have this authentic experience because usually when you come to Thailand and you try the food you just try it and you try to understand but now we got the, the background history of the food of the dishes how they are prepared and how, and we also um, got to know how you actually eat it because I have I would have never known that you actually eat Pad Thai the way that we ate it today. So yeah, I can highly recommend doing a Thai cooking class. Thank you. Thank you. After the cooking class, I sat back down to edit some more videos. I actually exported three vlogs today, published one vlog, uploaded the second one, and I'm still working on the third vlog. It's the first video from Helsinki, but I need a quick break. I need to grab some coffee. Uh, just because we barely had any coffee today and it's just nice to walk whoa cables <laughs> you know Bangkok. Bangkok is uh, is getting electrocuted paradise <laughs> then we're going to get some sunset shots on the rooftop of our hotel some shots by the beautiful pool that they have here and then finally we're gonna go out and explore some street food and eat more food and eat more food uh, but the Thai food I was just telling Nelly Early on, the Thai food seems to be helping my stomach because I haven't been too well thank with... You. Thank you. No, thank you. Crossing roads are dangerous in Bangkok. Yeah, don't block and cross roads. <laughs> Stop. Yes, no, yeah. No, no. 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 we hesitated. <laughs> Never hesitate. If you hesitate, you lose. Okay, okay, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. We should have gone, we gotta go. We gotta go. Run! Stop. Run! <laughs> ah, the coffee club, very good. Sounds like my kind of club. Yes, as I said, I was. I, my, my stomach still wasn't right from the food poisoning, but the spicy food here in Thailand kind of helped my stomach to feel good again. So. It's like medicine. It's like medicine. Not coffee. Shut up. Oh, finally, the first espresso of the day. Nice, nice, nice. Oh. So Nelly today, in, uh, during the cooking class, she confirmed that at the night market today, she's going to be eating scorpions and tarantulas. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think that is a local thing. You said... What did I say? That you would be eating that stuff. When did I say that? You said it this morning. No. Yeah, I got it on. I got it on. on yeah. <laughs> you, so yeah, you, you got a you got a chicken now. Mm. You got it. <laughs> so, Nelly's trying to take a picture with the floji, and people have to help her get into position because she's incapable of moving. Not too relaxed. I was hustling all day. Actually, <laughs> we we got up in the in the morning, had breakfast. Uh, I was editing videos before breakfast. I was editing videos after breakfast. Then we did the cooking class. Then I was editing videos again. Then we got the shots at the pool. Then we got the shots at the sunset. And then the hustle goes on when we go to Chinatown to explore street food in Bangkok. <clears throat> Maybe I feel relaxed because it's warm.
<laughs> I've been I've been preventing this moment for for a while now. It smells a little bit like uh, slightly uh, over ripened meat. Sorry, my eyes itching. <laughs> and I'm trying to buy time. Durian, here we go. Ah, wait, wait, wait. Ah, sorry, sorry. <laughs> How is it? Oh, it's Mike? Just having you on. <laughs> durian, this durian is good. But it was the aftertaste that was kind of different. <laughs> no. This has my aftertaste. Okay. Oh wow. Creamy. It's creamy. I didn't expect that. Look at this. It's creamy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you did, hit that thumbs up button right away and subscribe to the channel if you're new. Tomorrow we're traveling to the Philippines, which is going to be absolutely awesome. Can't wait to get back to the Philippines. If there's anything we should try in the Philippines, let us know in the comments down below. You still haven't commented down below, so let us know in the comments what we should try, where we should go, what we should do. And if you're from the Philippines and you want to meet up, then hit us up. We'll see you guys in the next vlog tomorrow. Goodbye. <laughs> yeah, I think Nelly loves the durian. It's so good. I love it. Hey guys, real quick before I finish this video, we've started a really awesome giveaway with a few other awesome creators. We're giving away a brand new GoPro Hero 6. You'll find all details linked down below. So hit that link, participate in the giveaway, share it with your friends, share it all over uh, Facebook and Instagram and everywhere. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.